Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel All About Electronics. So in this question, we have been given the open base circuit and here we have been given that the output voltage of the given circuit is equal to 2 volt. So here we have been asked to find the value of x. So here to find the value of the x, first of all let us find the expression of the output voltage in terms of these resistors. So here if you see, then on the input side we have a 2 voltages that is plus 12 volt and the minus 12 volt. So here to find the expression of the output voltage in terms of these resistors, first let us apply the principle of the superposition. So first let us assume that only this plus 12 volt is acting alone and this minus 12 volt is connected to the ground terminal. That means here we can connect this minus 12 volt to the ground terminal. So now if you see then the one terminal of this resistor is connected to the ground terminal. On the other end, because of the virtual ground, this inverting terminal will also act as a ground terminal. That means if you see, then this node will also act as a virtual ground. So in a way, both the terminals of this resistor is connected to the ground terminal. And therefore, no current will flow through this resistor. That means this resistor will act as if it is not connected in the circuit. So now, if you see the equivalent circuit, then this is how it will look like. So in this condition, let's say the output voltage is equal to VO1. That is the output voltage when only plus 12 volt is acting alone. So this output voltage VO1 can be given as minus R divided by R times 1 plus X times 12 volt. Because in general, as you know, for the inverting configuration, the output of the op can be given as minus RF divided by R1 times input voltage. So here this VO1 is equal to minus R divided by R times 1 plus X times 12 volt. Now that is equal to minus 12 divided by 1 plus X. So this will be the output voltage VO1 when this plus 12 volt is acting alone. So similarly, now let us find the output voltage when this minus 12 volt is acting alone. And at that time we will assume that this plus 12 volt is connected to the ground terminal. That means now we will assume that this plus 12 volt is connected to the ground terminal. So once again if you see, then because of the virtual ground, this node will act as a ground terminal. And as you can see, the other terminal of this resistor is also connected to the ground terminal. That means effectively, no current is flowing through this resistor. Or equivalently, it will act as if it is not connected in the circuit. So now, if we see the equivalent circuit, then this is how it will look like. So let's say in this configuration, the output voltage is equal to VO2. So in this case, that is equal to minus R divided by R times minus 12 volt, or that is equal to plus 12 volt. That means here, this VO2 is equal to plus 12 volt. That means for the given circuit, this VO1 is equal to minus 12 divided by 1 plus x while the VO2 is equal to plus 12 volt. That means if we see the overall output voltage or this V out is equal to VO1 plus VO2 or that is equal to minus 12 divided by 1 plus x plus 12 volt. So in the circuit we have been given that this output voltage is equal to plus 2 volt. So from this we can say that this minus 10 volt is equal to minus 12 divided by 1 plus x or that is equal to 1.2 is equal to 1 plus x. So from this we can say that this x is equal to 0.2. That means for the given circuit whenever the output voltage V out is equal to plus 2 volt then at that time the value of the x is equal to 0.2. So from this we can say that for the given question the value of the x is equal to 0.2.